Right, this is the food shop. Um, it's from Lidl. It's 118 pounds, and it is. There's two kids out there screaming. Just no one's being murdered. Just to let you know. Um, it was a restock, so I've got like lots of pasta and stuff, so that I don't have to buy it as we're going. Because I only do little like once every sort of three months or so. Um, so I have to buy less with my weekly shops. So I've got a little pasta. One of these is a meal for all of us. Um, and we do two of them a week. So it's like three weeks worth there. Two lots of spaghetti. Two lots of white bread flour. Five lots of plain flour. Um, I didn't take the last of anything. There was loads of everything in the shops. So I haven't left anyone else without. Um... The plain flat, they were self raising flowers. These are completely ripped. The bags, people had left these ones. They're completely ripped. So I thought, well, it doesn't matter because my loo's going to go in a tub anyway. So I just asked them to put it in a bag. Um, two lots of long life almond milk. Um, Aria's little peppers, she's already had them in the car. Two lots of cocoa powder because I'm completely run out. We went to make something this morning and we would run out. Um, I've got three of these because they're delicious and they're like 39p each and they're so yummy. Load of rice, load of Foxy's biscuits. He's got a really good date on them until next year and we run out of these all the time because he has them before bed. Um, tea bags for Ben, fruits for the kids' lunch boxes, three lots of mints. This will last us a week and a half. Um, a big garlic, two lots of cheese. Again, we do like one of these a week. Um, loads of chocolate chips just to replenish because we made um, we made this today and we used it all. Uh, brioches. We got some beetroot because what I just showed you was pumpkin bread and we've done courgette cake and we now want to make a beetroot one so we thought we'd try that. I got Ben a load of tuna because he likes his tuna sandwiches and tuna on his jacket potatoes. Um, and this was on offer. These were fifty five p a tin. Passata. Um, again, I just like to have these in the pantry because they're good for soups and for bolognese and most things that we make involve passata. Um, I got a fruit cocktail for Mika to try because she likes to have um, a fruit salad in her pack lunch. Gary, get off. Get off. Two lots of butter. Um, the kids chose these as a little treat. Two lots of kidney beans. Two lots of black beans. Seven tins of peeled potatoes. Um, I love these. I have these instead of like bread to dunk in my soups and stuff. Um, or have them with like an egg or whatever. Ari had them the other night. I had them with steak the other night. And I covered them in salt and pepper and garlic powder. And then air fried them. And they're amazing. And they're so cheap. And beans were £3.49 for six cans. So we got 12. Yes, yeah, so the beans. Very happy with that because um, we go through a lot of beans. These, these are so yummy, absolutely delicious. A big bag of carrots that I'm gonna peel and chop and then put in the freezer, ready for soups. Same, I've got loads of celery because I um, prepare it, chop it into little small chunks and I put it in the freezer because nobody likes celery, it's gross, but I hide it in all my stews and soups and bolognese and stuff and blend it up and the kids have no idea it's in there, but it's a vegetable in there, so it's a win. But, um, yeah, I just put it in the freezer. Ben got some cookies for the kids and a muffin by the looks of it. Um, two lots of salt, big bag of onions, caster sugar. Um, I've got these for the freezer. These are really nice. They're £1.49 for two. Um, and one pack of this will do all of us. Like Ben will have a whole one and then me and the kids will share the other one. Um, and then I've got three cans of beans with uh, sausages. So that is the... Um, shop and it's not really a like a weekly food shop it's just a top up pantry shop um but like for example like this as i said i'll have that um i do a really nice um bake where you get a tin of these you literally just get one big dish one big um roasting tray chuck a tin of that in some um broccoli cauliflower a tin of butter beans um some cooked little chunks of bacon um, peas, green beans, anything you want really, chuck it all in and then just pour a cheese sauce over it and put it in the oven and it's banging and it's a really cheap dinner. Um, bolognese, chilli, Cajun mints, soups, loads of stuff we do with that. Tuna for then, for sandwiches, potatoes, um, tuna pasta, um, 
the mints for again bolognese um chili uh, meatballs we mix it with pork mince and do it as meatballs um what else cajun mince burgers loads of stuff rice again with the chili with the cajun mince and um, we do egg fried rice occasionally which we really like um, or if we do a dal we have rice with it um the plain flour i use for soda bread um i like like a loaf of soda bread every week um which uses half of one of these and then cakes and stuff and then this if i want to make a proper loaf of bread pastas again cheese like uh, macaroni cheese we do um like bolognese with pasta you can mika has green cheesy pasta which is pesto cream cheese cheddar mixed together and then poured over the pasta so lots of just staple stuff and then there's gary again so yeah that is the little shop um if you've got any cheap meal ideas let me know that'd be awesome pop them down below and we can make like a little uh, collection of budget meals thought I would show you. Where's he put it all? Where's he put it? Um, all the celery and stuff. I literally just chop it up. Um, I've got like five bags of this, and then there's carrots as well, all in there. Look. And then I use each one for a stew, and that's it.